All right, it's on. Okay. This is Brian's hive. Um, got a very high level of rower, um, deformed wings, and the colony is getting quite weak. It needs to be a, a chuck swarm done on it before it goes down anymore. Um, hopefully there's still enough bees in there to do that. We're going to transfer these into a new box and then we'll feed it. So that's what our preparation is going to be. We're going to lift this box off, put it over onto the roof, put a new brew box here to do, to do the shook swarming to. This is a nut four brood box, the queen excluder first. You put the queen excluder on the bottom for a safeguard that the queen don't abscond. We'll take out a few sections, these are foundation only. What I like to do is put in one drawn one just so she can start laying. That's the gap in the middle to shake the bees into. So we're going to just check each one, shake the bees straight into. Very small, this is an outside one. No queen, just have a second look just so you can see the queen. Just give them a quick shake. Queen's on this one. She's on we got the, the queen on that one, so if we leave that one. Just, just leave there. There. Okay, you just keep hold of it there. Just, just leave it there. Just, just to keep your eye on it. You know the queen's got it. <laughs> Rowan's got it there. We're going to go all through these hives. <laughs> Can't see them. Oh yeah. Okay. 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 These bees are being shook in, everyone has to be shaken in and discard the brood because that's where all your row is going to be. All your that brood. I would like to see more bees here really, but it has gone down since last week, that's why we decided to do it now. Got the queen there, okay. And the guy's going to shake that last one in. There, so she's on completely new foundation, all the old brood, all this will be discarded because that's where all your mites are hiding. We're going to put eco over the top and we're going to feed the bees. Rapid feeder. Sugar syrup we're putting in there. And 
they probably need a couple of these because they're not that strong. We want to give them as much energy as we can. And just to make sure that they know it's there, we're just going to tip a little bit in the top here. Let it run down the side. Just so they know it's there. And that was a very quickly done as a shook, shook swarm. Not the right. This is the follow up from 10 days ago from the shook swarm. Notice there was a feeder. Looking on there. And you'll find now we've got one, two, one frame empty, and they've just started on this one. With obviously the sugar syrup because we've been feeding them sugar syrup. And we go in there now and we've got All that drawn cone with eggs in there and larvae in that side. Yeah. And they've just started sealing this. All nice new sealed brood. So this is within roughly 10 days. They are working on one, two, three, four, five, six, virtually seven frames they've drawn out. And they've got some extra drawn cone there to carry on. We're going to carry on feeding these. But it's just showing you how quick a short swarm will build up.